Many believe that Bitcoin is anonymous, like me. However, just because I'm wearing a mask, it doesn't mean you can't find out who I am. This is also true of Bitcoin. Without forensic analysis, any Bitcoin address used in the transaction is very likely to be traceable. This is why Bitcoin transactions are called pseudo-anonymous. With Bitcoin, all transactions and the wallet addresses involved are recorded on the public blockchain. They are open and available to all. The addresses alone don't reveal any identifiable details. However, they do provide a foothold for further investigation. Imagine your Bitcoin address like an email address or an online alias. How hard it is to trace your actions depend largely on what you do with it. For example, identity can be traced if you are using a private Wi-Fi connection. Here, we generally give proof of ID through which our identities can be matched against our IP. Similarly, say you publicly share your Bitcoin wallet address, perhaps on a forum, even if it's not shared with any identifiable details, you may have used the same username somewhere else. You may have shared identifiable details in another post under that username, which someone can track by looking through your posting history. From this post, for example, we can guess that her name is Charlotte and where she works. She may also have used an email address to sign up to the forum, which is also public. It's not hard to then connect the dots. Aha, Charlotte. You caught me. Anytime you share a Bitcoin wallet address, you make it possible for someone to link you to it. If you're buying something, the merchant is highly unlikely to bother tracing you, of course, and to do so is costly. It's especially important to note that because you can seal transactions that take place over the Bitcoin network, multiple Bitcoin addresses can be grouped together. They can then be tied to the same address. Therefore, if just one of these addresses is linked to a real-world identity through one or several of the de-anonymizing methods, all of them can be. Thanks for watching. Do you have any more questions you need answered? There's a comments box below. Use it. You might even get a mention in one of our videos. Also, remember to like and subscribe.